what's up what's up here i am again this time we have one beautiful onkyo stereo cassette deck or the reverse uh the model is tar301 uh it's a dolby bc nr hx pro uh, simple operating order reverse cassette deck uh, with a EQ bias uh, that would be like the simplest explanation and review <laughs> so yeah it also has quick order reverse it will uh, reverse your tape as soon as the uh, part of the tape was expired and it will not wait till the plastic part at the beginning at the end of the tape is rolled it will simply quick do quick order reverse which means if you are listening to the mixed tapes you will hear like a split second of pause between uh, when the, 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 the tape is actually a switch to another side. Neat! Two model logic control, uh, reverse mode, of course, MPX filter, Dolby BC, counter reset and repeat. Uh, so, yeah, it sounds good. I tried some normal tapes. fine and it will show you the direction here uh, the only thing that I notice is like a louder rewind and fast forward you see it's a little bit louder yeah and yeah I would like to try also to test a little bit to record something on it I will go and Fast forward tape a little bit, of course. I will set it up on Dolby B, Dolby C, counter reset, MPX filter, MPX filter off, AcuBIOS because it's a crumb, good crumb tape, I'll keep it in a mid. Input balance recording, let's try it. Okay, counter reset. So the level maybe a little bit lower. I would keep it there. Okay, we are listening to some electronic music and the noise from New York streets. a little bit more yeah copyright here I come okay now we're gonna have from zero oh now it's it's very good very good yeah So yeah, you can use AccuBIOS to precisely adjust nice balance between high and low tones. Um, the, if the t tape is not so good, you will go a little bit left. If the tape is better, you will go on the right side. And it's the, better, the best way is to try and test, as I did. So I would put it in the middle and I set up Dolby VC, okay. I would record it a little bit. Right. And then like when the counter is 15, I would turn the bias a little bit on the left side. 
so I know that I switched bias on 15 counter on the left side to get more highs. Let's see how it goes. I'm counting from the zero, zero, zero right now. This is, this is when the bias was in the middle. Now on 15 it will go on minus. A little bit of difference. So that's what uh, I would prefer a little bit lower volume of course and, and I would record on Dolby B like this. And then later I would try it without Dolby at all. Then I would get more highs. You see? With Dolby, without Dolby. A little bit more highs. <laughs> okay, so yeah, it's a basic auto reverse deck. It's nice if you have, I don't know if my camera can record the display in the proper color. It's kind of light green. If this is something like a whitish, light, light blue, whatever it is, this would be like a greenish green. So if you have other components from Onkyo and green display, yeah. And the deck is in nice condition. You see, it's they're not not so many you know signs of user scratches or something as you can see yeah neat not bad at all <laughs> uh, i think it, it is in good good looking condition and it works just fine so if you need a basic cassette deck this could be the one take care